We are grateful to the government of Bangladesh for providing for providing us shelters on humanitarian ground. We are also thankful to the UN and other concerned organizations for providing us with food, shelter, and other supports. But Bangladesh is not our country. We want to return our homeland, Mema. During 2017 and 18, several agreements were assigned by Bangladesh, MEMA, China, and UN. But till today, no visible and effective progressive has been made to repatriate us to MEMA. We, the Rohingya, are no stateless. We are not a stateless people. Our country is MEMA. Last year we got last year we got twelve dollar per capita in food aid from WFP. Now we are getting eight dollar in food aid. It is known that the amount of food aid will decrease further. The United Nations, we don't want food aid from you. We want to go back to our own motherland. So please help us to a quick repatriation with full right and safety, security, and dignity. The United Nations and world community, please do not stop repatriation. We don't want any verification, any scrutiny, any interview. It's just a conspiracy of delaying repatriation. Please do not stop repatriation. Don't ask Bangladesh to stop repatriation. We want to go back to our country as soon as possible through the UNICEF data card. Almost six years have passed since the exodus of 2017. How many days we will remain stateless? How many days will we be deprived of universal human rights? 
we no longer want to remain as titless. We are gravely anxious about the future of us and our future generation. We want to return to our motherland, our Khan in Mema. We want to live in Mema as citizen with our right. So we are earnestly arguing the world leaders and communities to come forward and help us to a quick repatriation, return to our homeland, Mema, and to live in Mema with our right. Thank you for listening to the voice of the Rohingya people are around the globe of the world and the international community. Thank you for all.